So welcome back everyone. As you can see, we're on the top loft right now. Um, it's completely empty. All of these birds have been uh, sent to like the first like training race, uh, which most of you guys know is like 30K, uh, maybe a little more. But yeah, we're out here waiting for them. Um, they should arrive here soon. Um, so yeah, stay tuned. So I guess the first three just arrived here. I'm filming against, oops, looks like here's one already. Oh, looks like another one just came on top, over top of the, the forest right there. Yeah, 30k is not a lot for these guys, so. Still gonna be flying a little and we also uh, didn't didn't show their hands uh, sometimes we show their hands even in the training training race just so they can get used to it keep in mind that oh you just got scared of me to drop I might have to move inside but yeah keep in mind that um 10 out of 12 of these guys are uh, yearlings which they haven't uh, flown on widowhood yet so i think one oh yeah looks like they're sitting here now so the one making all the noise is 611 i think yeah pretty sure it's 611 Those guys always uh, sit down there. I did uh, let them out yesterday with the young birds. That's why, so yeah, that's 611. He's used to going inside. Those are yearlings. Yeah, he's kind of uh, scared of me standing here. And then the two mealies right there, uh, gonna be shit birds, I already know, so. don't really know a lot about oh looks like one just oh yeah the black one just arrived as well come 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 looks like there's a predatory bird way way up there you can't really see it i can and it's one of those those dangerous ones as well Yeah, those two melees, I had them outside the entire day yesterday together with the young birds. So that's why he's uh, sitting over there. But yeah, uh, all in all, I don't know how many we have now. Two melees, six, eleven, and then these, these two guys. So that's five out of twelve. Oh, I just seen another one, like a shadow. Yeah, their hands are sitting right there, so they already know that as well. So yeah, this is where their hands are. And they can see through the glass. We should move them to another another loft or like paint this black uh, and make that soundproof to be ideal. Uh, but you know, nothing's really ideal uh, ever. So yeah, I'm gonna wait till a few more um, birds arrive because it's taking quite a while. So so. Yeah, the, these three are still sitting here. Just one just left. Oh, there might be. No. The other ones haven't arrived yet. 
one did go inside from the uh, the, the melees uh, 611 went inside by itself uh, like you could see but what actually surprises me and I wa what I wanted to talk about is um, there's there should be 10 10 yearlings on this loft meaning uh, two birds that aren't yearling uh, being 611 right there and then the grizzle uh, 611 is a three year uh, three year old and I think the grizzle is a two year old or also three year old um, which is pretty damn weird for him to not uh, like be on time keep in mind um, 611 and these five were basically home at 16 minutes uh, 16 minutes from like uh, 30 gatos which is very fast i do think they had had a tailwind but yeah it's still quite fast um so the more reason i think it's weird that uh, the grizzle did not make it home in time with them uh, and it's taking a lot longer like i would uh, expect for from the yearlings yeah we really have to do uh, something oh looks like another one arrived yeah some of these yearlings still want to go uh, inside with in their old loft i guess uh, so yeah that's their old loft does that the dark pencil or like check so i guess we do have half uh, half of the birds home now Bargo, oh, there he is. So, yeah, uh, I'll just wait here for a few more minutes uh, and then if anything arrives, I'll film it. And if not, I won't. So, so I just saw another blue bar here. That's not the one that just flew up. The one that just flew up went inside in the tree, I think, right there. But yeah, this one arrived still quite straight from the liberation spot and way up high, so I think it's a new bird. We do have more than one uh, regular blue on this loft, so I don't know where it went, I just saw it. Oh, here it is. Oops, that was fast. So yeah, that's it. I'll just sit inside a little bit so it doesn't get scared. Trying to drop. I can't see it anymore. May have. Or yeah, here it is. So that's the one that just arrived. So. That means we have seven and uh, still no sign of the grizzle, uh, which is again, very weird. So another, the other pencil just dropped as well. We have two pencils. Uh, one is the older one. And then this one is a yearling pencil. Uh, obviously one being 611 and then, yeah, this is the older guy. These guys kind of look alike, but uh, one's quite a lot darker than the other one. For some reason, that one seems to be tired, hanging his feathers low. But yeah. So I don't know how many that marks now, but like eight or something. But yeah, I'm not gonna wait for the other guys that have uh, stuff to do today, so... Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this uh, little training toss, uh, training race video. Uh, nothing really too much to be made out of it. Out up of it. Um, we'll see how they do the first actual race. Uh, there, sh there should have been a race this season, but it actually got cancelled because of the bad weather. This weather is like the best we have had in probably the past two weeks so that's why they did the training toss but yeah anyways you guys i hope you enjoyed today's little uh, 
small video. Uh, as always, leave a like, comment, subscribe and have a good day.